uh, if you got errands to run and things to do, I'd still make it Saturday and I'd be on the lookout for those strong storms developing Sunday afternoon and Sunday evening. Weather watchers are sort of celebrating the fact that they had some sun in the area in some spots today. I don't know if you had much sunshine uh, because it's been cloudy, then it's been uh, uh, sunny at times. Here's Bourbon A. It was great to see the sun and blue sky again. That's from uh, David and he uh, sent along a picture. Man, there were some areas that had that bright a sky. It was nice today in some neighborhoods. Let's move on. Talk about uh, what's headed in this direction. Now the clouds will increase as the night wears on tonight. It, it won't interfere with Friday night plans. Any rain that falls will start to fall in the morning. So by nine o'clock in the morning, we should have rain around the area. Official temperatures 46 at O'Hare, 48 at Midway, slightly warmer south of the city. Northeast winds we've been talking about keeping a chill in the air. They're between uh, 10 and 20 miles an hour around the lakefront now. So showers tomorrow, a bigger storm threat comes for us and milder weather on Sunday. So make sure you have a way of staying alert uh, Sunday to, to the weather changes. And here's Futurecast painting our sky and giving us temperatures through the overnight hours. Here comes the rain, the first batch. That's 10 o'clock in the morning, 44 degrees with an east wind, about nine miles an hour. And then Saturday wears on and without a big uh, storm threat. And then the storm clouds arrive and look at all those shades you usually see in the spring popping up in uh, relatively mild weather on Sunday afternoon. So tonight uh, we'll get down to 43. We'll keep that east wind at about 10 to 20 miles an hour for the next seven days. Trouble spot Sunday and then back to cooler than normal conditions, but at least sunshine by the end of the week next week. Okay, thank you, Steve.